Okay. So, here we go. Ooh, starting the stream. Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome to another Booty by Brett at Home Fitness Challenge. You're here with Trainer Rocky, and today we're going to be getting into the second week of the second month of the Booty by Brett at Home Fitness Challenge. Now, mind you, we started a little earlier, so this is going to be week seven for us, okay? But it's going to be the second week in the new month, okay? So this time we're going to be adding repetitions just like last month. And, you know, with that, we're still going to be working on our form, making sure that we have good biomechanics during our lifts, feeling it in the right muscles during the lifts, not having any sort of compensations so that next week when we add additional weights to our workout, we can do that safely. Okie dokie. So go ahead and grab your accountability partner, grab your uh, brother, grab your sister, and let's go get on to this workout, okay? Woohoo! All right, so things that you will need today are gonna be the dumbbells. Now remember, y'all have been tracking your progress. So I want you to take a look at what you did last week. Get those dumbbells out and ready to go for your workout. Okay, so for me, I am going to be using the barbell. We also started using uh, dumbbells in our routine, okay? Um, grab the exact same weight because we're just doing additional reps here. All right, so first station, um, we're going to be doing the dumbbell reverse deficit lunges second station is going to be the bench press and then we got good mornings inverted rows and then knee banded pause barbell hip thrust okay so i'm going to give you a minute to just go grab that stuff really quick and i'm going to grab it as well so be right back Mind you, you will need a broomstick for your inverted rows, okay? So you're going to put your broomstick across the chairs to do your inverted rows. If you don't have an inverted row machine like I do, okay? And then also, if you don't even have that, like a broomstick, then you're doing whatever you did body weight style last time, okay? So for those of you who are doing body weight, uh, we'll, we'll talk about it a bit when we get there, okay? But I'd hope you get some, get some equipment by this time, you know? So you can, you know, at least push yourself somewhat, you know? Mm -hmm. Maybe, maybe just me, I'm the only one. Okay, um, but yeah, cause if you're serious about staying fit, you need to, you know, invest in the equipment for it. Alrighty, so let's go ahead and do our warm up. I'm going to just do some chair squats. So sitting down, pushing through the heels, standing up, making sure I start with the back pockets back and then standing up, pushing through that heel. And I'm going to just do 10 little reps here just to kind of get everything move in, squeeze the glutes at the bottom, push through those heels. Okay. Exhale on that push. Inhale and return. Make sure you're actually hip hinging. Okay. And not just sitting down. You want to actually push your back pockets back when you sit down okay now let's do some butt kicks I mean what you say I mean what you do and then you gotta get jiggy with it mm. Mm. jiggy with it mm. Mm. Yeah. Mm. some high knees so I feel like this one should be more of like you know those like girls that go 
Boo-doo. So we need some like a boo doo boop boo doo music. You know, just getting those hip flexors nice and toasty. Toasty roasty. Woo! Do, do, do. Do, do, do. Good. Nice. Nice job. All right, now let's do some ankle circles. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ooh, watch me, watch me, ooh, watch me. Oh, and then the other way. Hey. And then the other way. Nice. And then I want to work on some ankle mobility here. So I'm just going to place my foot here. And then I'm going to try to stretch that knee past the foot while keeping the heel planted. Give me a little bit of ankle mobility during my workout today. Woo! Nice little stretch there for that ankle. Pushing it into dorsiflexion just so we have a nice range of motion there. Good job, y'all. Okay, let's get the arms warmed up. Gotta get a little jiggy with the arms. Jiggy jiggy with it. Do do do. Woohoo! Bit rate staying good. That's good. Thank the Lord. Hey. 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 Okay. And then let's go. Pat yourself on the back. Pat yourself on the back. You're so good. You're so awesome. I love you so much. Good job, Rocky. Good job, Fit Fam. Woohoo! Good job. Up, oh, showed up for another stream. Showed up for another workout. Woohoo! Good job. Okay, and then let's warm those wrists up. So we're gonna go boo -dee boo boo boo, and then the other way. Ooh, I'm getting better at that, and then and then reverse it. Nice. Okay. So we got reverse lunges and good mornings today. So let's work on our hamstrings a little bit. We're gonna exhale, fold, inhale, come up, and then exhale, fold, inhale, come up. Kind of getting that core ready. For our good mornings. Good. And then I'm going to do like a really slow rounding of the back. And then I'm going to reach up into a back bend. And then exhale. Folding over. Inhale to a half tabletop, exhale, folding over again, inhale, into a slight back bend. Okay, now, sorry if you don't have a foam roller, but if you do, grab your foam roller. I'm gonna just roll my back out before I start my workout. Okay, now I really just want to take a nap, but we're going to get through this workout. We're going to get through it. Ooh, little baby sit up. Okay, let's work on some functional breathing for the workout. So, you place one hand on the belly, one hand on the chest. 
and breathe into the belly. Keep the hands still. And then I want you to put your hands around your waist and try to push out against the fingers. So this is warming up our diaphragm. And then the last part is strong exhale, like you're trying to make your ceiling fan turn. And then you depress those ribs down. Good. Nice. And I'm going to give myself a little twisty twist like a pretzel. Hi, Nikki. Oh, gross. I don't need your kisses. Oof. Okay, now we sit up ever so slightly, turn to your side, and then push yourself up, okay? So be careful about getting up. You don't want to hurt yourself before you start your workout. Thanks for the hydrate, Resurrect. And Seth, welcome to the Fit Fam. Welcome, welcome, friend. How's it going? Okay, y'all, I feel pretty ready for the workout. So, let's get into it. <sighs> now that we got our abs and our diaphragm working for us, we're gonna start with the deficit reverse lunges. So, um, get it like a stack of textbooks, just a little bit. It doesn't have to be terribly tall. Okay, so like two or three textbooks will do. And then we're gonna go into those deficit reverse lunges, starting with um, for those of you who are just doing reverse lunges, remember, okay, there's three stages here. The beginning stage is body weight, where you just do reverse lunges, and you're gonna try to get 20 each leg. The second option is dumbbell reverse lunges. So if you have weights and you're doing reverse lunges, then you're gonna do 15, then 12, and then 10 um, reps, okay? So I'll go over this again. And I'm gonna be doing the third option, which is the hardest one, where it's gonna be 12 reps, 10 reps, and then eight reps, okay? So make sure you do the same weight you did last week. Okay, so I start out with body weight for 12 reps. And then, hey, Jado, what's going on? All right, so let's grab our weights. And if you're doing a deficit, let me know. If you have any questions, let me know. Let's get into the workout. Here we go, 12 each leg. So on this one, you're going to take a step back. Pause, straighten your hips out, inhale all the way down, and then you're gonna hover the knee. Exhale, pushing through the heel of your front foot. Okay, then inhale, pause, straighten everything out. Two. Three. Now we're getting into it, okay? Four, if you have questions, let me know. Five. Stick with the same weight you did last week, seven. Add two additional reps to your set, okay? Eight. Nine. 10. 11. 12, I'm gonna do two more here. Fourteen. Woo! Okay. Switch sides. Inhale the way down. Exhale on the push. Pushing through the heel of your shoe on that front standing leg. Keep breathing. 
using the diaphragm. Do two more reps. Fourteen. Good job. Woohoo! Felt a good burn there. Okay, we're gonna rest for three minutes. Three minute rest period. stretch out feel free to stretch a little bit not too terribly much talk to your gym buddy hi is there something that I can do for you are you oh, quit trying to snipe a kiss on me <sighs> hey Sealy I already gave you like all the treats why do you want more huh you little piggy. You're a little piggy. Why didn't I do it for you? Like little Miss Piggy. Didn't I give you more treats? Didn't I give you all the treats? Missy. She's got a subluxation. You need an adjustment. Mm hmm. You need a little justy just. There you go. There you go. He's a good girl. Yes. Oh my gosh. Hey, what's up, do? Do we? Do na? Do na How's it going? And Joda do Mato. That sounds like that sounds like Dutch or something. Joda do Mato. No. No. All right, y'all. We got forty-five more seconds on this next one. Make sure you do the same weight you did last time. I did five pounds. Whatever you did, do that one. If you're doing the dumbbell reverse lunges, you're going for 12 to 14 reps each. If you're doing just deficit or body weight reverse lunges, you're doing 20 each leg still. And then for those of you who are doing following me, we're going for 10 to 12 reps each leg. All right, y'all, let's get to it. This is the hard part, you know, it's just getting through this first set, but we got it. The first station. Nothing. They ain't got nothing on us. Lord Jesus, give me strength. Okay, here we go. Here we go. A little motivational dance. Mm -mm -mm. All right. I'm going to start with my least favorite leg, the right one. Here we go. Inhale on the way down. Inhale on the way down. Exhale on that push. Pushing through the front leg. Ten to 12 reps, I'm going for 12, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, That was 12. Oh, that was 12. That was easy. Okay. 
Okay, I'm going for the other side. Here we go. Halfway. Mr. Krabs. Okay. <sighs> Sorry. I know I'm breathing super loud. It's probably so annoying. I'm gonna turn down the mic just a smidge. So y'all don't only hear just the huff and the puff and I'll blow your house down. Ooh. Ain't that right, little Miss Piggy? Ain't that right, little Miss Piggy? Oh, you a piggy. I gave you all the treats already. And you just want more and more and more. <sighs> She's a little bit spoiled. Can you tell? I spoil her a little too much. She gets a little bit too much spoils. Where's my mouse? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Oh, it's dying. It's dying. Don't die. Beep at me. Beep at you. There it is. Okay. So, should be feeling this in those quads and glutes. Okay. Quads and glutes. Now, if you don't feel it there, and you feel it in the back or something, you could be uh, kind of like lifting with the back instead of lifting with the glutes, okay? So make sure you drive through the heel of your shoe, okay? Drive through the heel of your shoe to avoid the back doing the work, okay? Notice when I'm here and I just push through the heel it forces my leg to go straight and forces me to stand up. Okay. Hey, Conrad. What's going on? Hey, buddy. I don't know. What do you want to learn today? Well, you, you can ask me something. I can teach you. I can teach you something. All right, y'all. Last set. For those of you who are doing deficit body weight reverse lunges, again, you're doing 20 reps each leg. If you can't get to 20, don't beat yourself up. Just do what you can do and write it down. And the next week, try to do a little bit more. Okay, so wherever you're at is totally okay. For those of you who are doing dumbbell reverse lunges, you're going for 10 to 12 reps each leg. Now remember, we did 10 last week, so the goal is for 12 this week because we're doing additional two reps, okay? For those of you who are following along with me, and have dumbbells and the little step up, we're gonna be doing eight each leg, plus two, so we're going for 10. Okay, so we're going for 10 here. Now remember, grab the same weight you had last week and just do two additional. So you should be using the same weight. Now I'm gonna go grab my tins, because this is what I used last week for this last set here. Oh, okay. What you eating? All right, let's get it, y'all. So, I'm going to start with the right leg again. Inhale on the way down. Stepping back, make sure those hips stay square. Exhale on that push. <sighs> Breathing into the belly. That's 
six, seven, eight, nine, one more, 10, switch sides, one, Seven, eight, <sighs> ten. Nice job. Station one complete. Okay. I'm going to turn down my mic just a little bit more. Okay, so what does exclamation alert, alert mean? Um, bowl of tuna, hot dish. Hmm. Lots of protein in that then. I guess that's a good high protein meal. Sounds good. Is it spicy? really weird wedgie. Okay. For those of you who are listening on the YouTube, if you made it this far, you can give a winky sign in the chat, in the comments. <laughs> okay. So, second station, we got the bench press. Okay. So, pause. If you don't have a bench or dumbbells, you're doing the pause deficit push-up. Okay. So, or just pause push-ups. Okay, deficit means that you're going lower. So you're gonna have two textbooks like so, okay? And then when you go down into the push-up, you go below them and then push, okay? So you're pausing and then you push. For us, so you're gonna pause at the bottom, okay? That's as many reps as you can do, all right? And then for those of us who have the dumbbell, we're gonna do three sets of eight. One second at the bottom, okay? Pausing. Now I had, I had five pound dumbbells last time, so that's what I'm gonna grab for this time. And we're gonna go for 10 reps, okay? So remember, look back at what you did last week and do two more. Okay, we're adding two more reps. Now, if you're doing body weight, try to get two more. Obviously, if you're doing dumbbells, grab the same weight. We're adding two reps and we're gonna shoot for 10, okay? Conrad says, nope, not spicy, just noodles, tuna, peas, pretty much. And I sprinkle just a bit of cheese. Yum, noms, what kind of cheese? I love cheese. Cheese and I are best friends. Cheese, cheese and I, we have, we go back real far. You know, I like me some cheese. Cheese is good. Don't make fun of my, her. If you do, I'm gonna come at you. I'm gonna get you. Oh my God, I'm so sorry. That was a little loud. But my barbell got stuck here. Let me just move this out of the way. Okay, y'all. It's been two minutes. Let's get it. Or three minutes. Let's get it. I'm just bringing it out a little bit so you can see a little better. Okay. Whew. Here we go. Sit back. Nice, slow, and controlled. Find a good spot for your feet. Shoulders down and back, wrist straight, exhale on that punch. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, I gotta find a better spot for my feet, hold on. <laughs> okay, there we go, that's better. Something stable, okay? Make sure your wrist stay straight. 
Inhale, nice, slow, and controlled. Pausing, going a little bit deeper into that. Inhale, nice, slow, and controlled. Notice my ribs are not flaring. Give yourself a strong exhale to bring those ribs down. And the dumbbells are at 45 degrees of each other, okay? So I'm not here. I turn them 45 degrees so that they kind of make a V, upside down V. Pausing at the bottom for a second. I just did one more for the left because my left side's weak because I flipped my bike when I was little. Okay, so if y'all had any questions um, on the grip here, so I am, let me just undo. Oh, wait. Ah, screw it. So I'm grabbing it like this. The wrists are straight, like so, and then what I'm doing is instead of punching forward like this, I turn the dumbbells so they make like an upside down V and I'm flying like that, okay? Like that. Now, everyone's biomechanics are a little different. Everyone's built a little different. So do what's comfortable for you, okay? If you, you feel like here, is good but this is even better than do it like that um, also when you're laying on a bench or when you're doing your push-ups you don't want the back to arch super aggressively try to keep a neutral spine and then tuck in those ribs okay now for those of you who are like power lifters and you do Sorry, there's a horse fly in here. Y'all, I need another uh, net for mosquitoes. I'm tired of these bugs flying in. But if you need, if you're a power lifter, it's a little different, okay? They have a different form than what I coach, okay? Now, everyone's a little different in their coaching style. I just prefer a more neutral position to kind of just, you know, work on my form, okay? I just don't want to hurt my back, that's all. I don't want to do too much to it. All right, let's get it. Shoulders down and back, 10 reps. Tuck in that chin, tuck in those shoulders, squeeze those shoulder blades together. <sighs> nice, strong exhale, wrists flat, Punch the ceiling, punch through it. Inhale all the way down, pausing at the bottom. <sighs> Exhale that punch. Job. Woo also, I forgot to <clears throat> I forgot to mention that when I'm coming down, I'm um I'm my arms are not here. Okay, they're like here. Notice the difference between here and here. They're also at 45 45 degrees. Okay, um, mainly because the pec it attaches from the shoulder. And it, it kind of makes like a triangle. So if I could like show you what it looks like, it kind of looks like 
a triangle. So you have the pec that goes like this. Okay, so it attaches up here on the shoulder and it crosses like this. Now if I'm here, then notice I'm only really targeting these fibers if my arms are out here and I'm pushing it that way. Now if I drop my arm like this, it hits more of a different angle to target more of the middle belly of the pec. So that's kind of why I do it that way. But again, everyone trains differently, so it's not like terrible to do it that way. That's just how I do it. That was two sets. We got one more set here. 30 more seconds on the clock. Here we go. Y'all ready for this? Okay, here we go. Time for some massive pecs. Let's go. I know you guys, fellas, are loving this one. <sighs> Girls, you'll thank me later. <sighs> when you're older. <sighs> Five. Pausing at the bottom. <sighs> Make sure you keep that tension, though. Don't just let it go. <sighs> like Elsa. <sighs> We're trying to keep that tension, okay? Keep that tension, keep that tension, so you can build massive pecs, oh yeah, massive pecs, so we can do the titty dance. Sorry, I know I'm cringe, hardcore. All right, I think I got one more. So we're going to go into our third station. We are almost done. Three out of five, y'all. We're going on for the third station out of five. This one is going to be good mornings. Okay, so good mornings involve a lot of hip hinging. Excuse me. So when you're doing these, I want you to try to get a, close to a wall. Okay so that you have some target to reach for. And you're gonna pretend you have back pockets, you know, like boom, right there. Your back pockets need to go back. Okay, so bring those back pockets back until you hit the wall. Knees should stay slightly bent, okay? But we're not, we're not bending them any more than this, okay? And then from here, you're going to exhale and drive through the heel of your shoe. So back pockets back. You're here. Driving through the heel of your shoe. Now that's how you do a good morning. Okay. Wakey, wakey, eggs and bakey. We're going to get some um, bacon up in here. Yeah. We're going to be baking them glutes. Okay, so this is like a lower back and a glute exercise. Now, I prefer to feel it more in the glutes, but it is technically our back, um, lower back and glute exercise. Um, mainly glutes though, mainly, mainly glutes. You will use a little bit of the core to kind of hold yourself up. It's more of an accessory muscle right here. Now, we're gonna start with body weight and, wait, do we have, we did the bench press, yes. Good mornings. Okay, so we're gonna start with body weight and let me just double check what I did on my end. I did body weight and we're doing 12 reps. 12 reps, okay, here we go. 
for this one, I'm going to sing. <sighs> Exhale those ribs down. Keeping those ribs still. <sighs> Knees slightly bent. Go as far as you can until you feel a nice little stretch on your hamstrings. And then start to push the world away. Through the heel of your shoe, okay? So. <sighs> a good warm up here for your next set when we're going to add weight. <sighs> Push through the heel. Three. Bury those feet into the ground. Really get a good contact. Push, push, push away. Four. Five. Make sure you're not hunching over. Keep that chest up. Six. Inhale on the way down. Back pockets back. Seven. Keep going. Eight. I'm feeling the burn. Ten. Feet should be shoulder width apart. Eleven. One more. Rest up. There's a nice little burn there. We're going to rest for three minutes. Okay, three minutes. Now, I felt that mainly in the lower glutes and hammies. Okay, lower glutes and hammies. Hi, Nancy. Um, some things to avoid during this exercise. So, uh, hunching, if you're hunching, make sure you try to brace your core, engage your lats, like you're breaking a bar, okay? Um, another thing could be going down too far and bending at the knees, okay? So it's a straight, straight knee here, not with a slight bend but we don't want to be squatting, okay? So try to keep the knees sort of straight when you're doing it. And then also, um, go to where you feel comfortable, okay? So I'm really tall, I have really long legs, so honestly I feel very comfortable here in my good morning. Some of you who have shorter legs Maybe all the way out here, you know? Um, it just depends on where you're at and what's comfortable for you, okay? Next, we're gonna grab some weight for our good mornings. I was doing 10 pounds, so I'm gonna set up my weight. Of 10 pounds. Nancy some love. Too good for the girl. Too good for the girl. Okay. Um, let me set up my barbell here. It's nice that we have longer rest periods because then I could not have to worry so much about getting weights. Always ready. In time. 
You don't need the ditties. So. <laughs> hey, Resurrect, are you awake, buddy? Resurrect. Resurrect. Where are you at? Don't make me you come and get you. Hey, Conrad, thanks for the biddies, by the way. Yo, mods. Where are my mods at? Thank you. Can we can we get a mute, please? For like a timeout for like a minute. Thank you. I don't need that. Here, I'll just do it. Anyway, hey, thanks, Conrad, for another uh, 200 biddies. Yeah, it's something I got to deal with on the daily. Why are the biddies notes so loud, y'all? I don't know. I don't like it. I don't like it. My alert box volume. Eh, whatever. Who cares? <laughs> I guess Resurrect's asleep. Okay, let's get into the second set. We're going for... Oh man, I didn't do two additional, but whatever. We're going to do 12 this time. Okay? I was doing good form. So same thing here. Feet shoulder width apart. Inhale and way down. So nice stretch. Going for 12 reps. Pushing through the heel of your shoe. Let's get it. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Two more. Eleven, y'all. I'm freaking shaking. Ooh. Ooh. Twelve. Woohoo! Nice. All right, another three-minute break. That was nice. That felt good. I liked that one. I will hold the door open for them. LOL. <laughs> A line, bro. Yeah. Um, hold the door open. Like Hodor. Are you gonna go Hodor? Hold the door. Hold the door. Silly. Resurrect sleeping out there and just all of a sudden now he's second. Now he's second. <laughs> I thought you had to go to bed. Hmm. Are you just staying up just to chill and chitty chat with me? Keep me company? That's so sweet. You're so sweet. Alright, y'all. We got one more set here. Trying to see if I can edit my alert box volume. <laughs> Settings. I don't know. What are they doing? They do. Are they a little loud to you? Are they a little loud for you guys? 
Or is it okay? It's a little loud. Oh my goodness, you took me into the shower. <laughs> Uh-oh. It's okay for you? Um, a few things left to do for work in eight hours. Nice. Resurrect! Where were you? Brother just sleeping on me. I had to do everything. Jeez. Over here. Some dude making inappropriate comments and my mods just sleeping, letting it all slide by, letting this dude be so rude to me. Wow, man. And you got second, now you're second in bits. Wow. Now you're second in bits. Somebody just surpassed you, sir. You're getting left behind. Getting left behind. It's okay. That's why I have mod abilities available to me as well. All right. Time for a third set. Third set. Going for 10 reps. First in gifted subs. Oh, you know what? That's true. That's true. Uh, no. You weren't being rude, Conrad. You weren't the one. You weren't being a troublemaker. We all know who is being a troublemaker. All right, here we go. We're going for 10. Here we go, 10 out of 10, let's get it. Back pocket's back. Push the world away. Bury your feet in the sand. Make sure you squeeze that peach. Four. It wasn't Conrad. Yeah. Five. I already timed the dude out. First time I ever gave on my stream, but whatever. Six. Seven. Eight. Two more. Make them count. Nine. Nice. Alright, y'all. Next station we got is the inverted rows. Now be mindful if you don't have inverted rows, it's totally fine. You could just do banded supine single arm pull downs. Okay. So with the banded supine single arm pull down, you're gonna throw it over a table or a door and then just boop, okay, from the band. Now, if you don't have that, I don't know, you get some dumbbells or water bottles and then just row like this, okay? So, let's get into it, my friends. Let's do it. Like Palpatine says, do it. Do it. Resurrect, I'm giving back the abs for now because we're doing full body. I'll see how I feel later. Um, okay, so on the row, exhale on the row, inhale on the way down, okay? Now squeeze those, uh, squeeze your back. This is a back exercise, so that's where you should primarily be feeling it. Last time I got 10, eight to 10 reps, so I'm shooting for 10, for 10, for 10. Okay, that's what I'm going for. I can't remember what grip I did. Was it overhand? No, it was underhand. Okay, here we go. This is where we really build our calluses and our man hand. Here we go. Okay, resting for two to three minutes. 
um, on that one. Okay, rest them for two or three minutes. Whew. Alrighty, no problem, Resurrect. Ooh. See if I can balance on this. Oh, my feet. That hurts. How do people walk on tight ropes? Ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> I'm being silly. Everyone doing some kung fu fighting. Ooh. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna balance on it. Ooh, that's hard. Okay, we're just gonna sit on it. We're just gonna sit on it and chill and rest. Rest, I'll work on my, my posture, make sure I'm sitting up properly. I gotta set a good example for y'all. I can't be over here like resting like this, like the kids do on the playground, you know, when they're sitting up for recess. Misty one's outside, again. Or not, you know, you're an indecisive dog, that's fair. You are my child, at least. You know, you are my child. How did that open again? Do I have a ghost? Stay. <sighs> okay. Has it been two minutes yet? It's been a minute, 50 seconds. What is my microphone picking up? I don't understand. Okay. There we go. Ooh, 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 Here we go. Whoa, oh, oh. As ah, Conrad says. Oh, 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 oh. Here we go. Let's get it. Exhale on that row. Inhale on the way down. Nice, slow, controlled reps, friends. Here we go. Four, Jesus. I love you. Give me a string. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ooh. Ten. I'm dead. I'm dead. I've killed the lats. The lats are on fire. I've terminated them. Okay, rest time. Take a break. Sorry, I'm doing an Arnold impression right now, and it's not that good. How do I go to timeout jail? Where's timeout jail? I just literally hit timeout in the, in the, yeah, quite literally, like, timed the dude out for life. Eh, whatever. Hmm, I don't see it. That's fine. That is fine. Okay, y'all. I'm feeling that in the biceps. Ooh, my belly's hanging out. Yes, look at these biceps. Y'all are always asking me to flex my biceps for whatever reason. Here you go. Here you go, fans. Fit fam loves the biceps. I actually have a little little baby definition. Oh, I shouldn't do that too much. Oh, I'm going to hurt myself by flexing too hard on them, on them, on them boys. Flexing biceps for free. Oh, it's windy outside. That was a little spoopy. That was a, a little extra spoopy. Okay, y'all. Mentally prepare yourselves. We're going into the last set. I'm so excited. 
Can't you tell I'm so excited? I'm the most inspirational fitness influencer out there. I am so inspirational, aren't I? And motivational with my monotone. Are you ready? Okay. Let's go! We got this. Friends, family, brethren, sisters, unite! Let's get it. Two. the max on that one okay y'all we got one more set oh how oh now called a popo she needs the ambo <laughs> i'm done not literally you know just dead inside just the usual okay y'all we got one more station and it's gonna be hip thrust ooh, 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 ooh. I love me some hip thrusts, y'all. Can you tell? I'm so stoked. Okay, I'm gonna put on my shoes so I can get a little extra oop, oop, oop in it. And we're gonna start with knee banded body weight hip thrusts. For those of you who are choosing option one, is gonna be knee banded body weight hip thrusts. So you're gonna get a couch and you're just gonna do body weight hip thrusts. Now, if you don't have a band, who cares? You can use a belt and just wrap the belt around your knees and then tighten it so that you have about like this much. Okay, so like shoulder width and you just press out against the belt. Okay, so you don't really need a band, but as long as you have something to like press out against, that's fine. You're going for 20 reps, okay? Option number two is gonna be knee banded dumbbell hip thrust. So if you have like a water bottle, you can grab the water bottle or a gallon and you grab the gallon, put it on your hips and you're going to do 20 reps as well there. Okay. So that's just a little additional challenge. Now, remember we're adding two reps to what you did last week. So whatever you did last week, do two more additional reps. And option three is going to be knee banded pause barbell hip thrust. So we're going to be pausing at the top with our barbell for one second. Okay. And for that option, it's gonna be 15, 12, and 10. Now for us, since we're adding two, it's gonna be 17, 14, and 12. Don't let me forget it. We need to do two extra. Okay, peeps? All right. Grab your weight. Grab your bands. I'm gonna put up my contraption here my evil back contraption. Nice, I'm gonna put this up. Choo, 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 choo. Chugga, chugga, choo, choo. I'm okay. Okay, don't miss out on the hip thrust, my friends. This is where your booty is gonna be built. Okay, this is literally gold. Quite literally, gold for the for the booty. Sorry, I'm trying to get a good angle here. Y'all see my little Eevee slippers? Aren't they cute? Sorry, my, my camera's getting pulled. Okay. Okay, that works, right? It's still moving slowly. I think it'll stop here in a second. Okay, yeah, that's good. Now, I'm gonna put on some shoes for this one. So I'm gonna just slip on my shoes. And I did 20 pounds first. And the last one goes, good thing it, I was paying close enough attention to remember the numbers. 
Yay! Good job, Conrad! Woohoo! Okay, so I'm pulling up my socks all the way. Super nerd time, yeah. All right, let me grab my band. I did not write down the band I used, but I'm assuming I went with the blue band. Yeah, we'll just try the blue band first. Put that sucker on. Oh, not? Sorry, I can't read. I was not paying close enough attention to remember the numbers. Oh, okay, that's fine. So first, people who are doing option one is 20 reps. Option two is 20 reps. Now if you're doing the barbell, it's gonna be uh, 17, 14, and 12, okay? So it's either 20 reps if you're doing the banded without the barbell, or if you're doing like a heavier barbell one, we're gonna go up in our weight each time. So whichever one you're doing, I'm doing the heavy barbell one starting with 17 reps with 20 pounds. Okay, now mind you, I've been doing this for a long time, so don't beat yourself up if you're not right there with me, okay? Just be proud of where you are now. All right, here we go. So, we're gonna inch our way down to the bottom here, okay? Put those feet out. Now, I want you to exhale on that push, pushing through the heel of your shoe, all the way through the world, hold it at the top. Inhale on the way down. <laughs> Good, you wrote it down, okay. Okay, that's two. We're going for 17 here. Let's get it. Three. Pausing at the top, inhale on the way down. Exhale on that push. Four. Five. Squeeze in at the top. Seven. Push out against that band. Always, always, okay? Make sure the band stays constantly pushed out. Eight. <laughs> Nine. Thank you. I can't count sometimes, you know? You know me too well. Ten. Counting can be a little hard. I feel like I already messed this one up, but that's okay. 11, y'all, I'm starting to feel it. 12, 13, I'm gonna try to rip it out here. 14, 15, 16, pull the weight down. 17, oh my God, my butt. Ugh. I mean, Lord, I love you so much. Oh, okay. Mm. We survived. All right, y'all, if you're not feeling that in the peach, one of the I struggle counting when I have two box thing and it gets five and I'm like, wait, do I add one or two more? <laughs> yeah, I feel you. I feel you. Sometimes I'm like, one, two, three, four, five, and then I'm like, 16, 17, no, wait, no, eight, nine, ten, I'm like, 20, and then I'm like, no, 11. <laughs> I just go back and forth between single digits and double digits. I don't know why my brain does that. Okay, so resting up here, two to three minutes. We're gonna do two minutes because I was chatting. And I'm gonna add additional weight. Oh my God. Oh, can I do it? I think I can, I think I can, I think I can. I think I can. Okay, we're gonna do 30 pounds. Okay. Y'all hype me up in the chat. Let's get it. Let's do some motivation. 14 reps, okay? So, oops, sorry, that was loud. That was loud as hell, I know. Sorry. 
I know your ears are probably ringing like, what the is she doing? Hey, we'll know my name. What's going on? Uh-oh, y'all, my bit rate is super duper low. Please tell me I didn't crash. I crashed. Great! Hmm. No! When did we crash? Gosh dang it. Freaking A, y'all. I'm so upset right now. Why is it crashing? <sighs> y'all. Sorry my bit rate is like literally sucks right now. We lost the stream for a sec. Where did y'all last? What did y'all see last? Um, hey, Will saw a transformation on TikTok, inspirational. Thanks, bud. Thank you. All right, let's just finish this set. I'm upset, because now I can't post my YouTube video I'm gonna have to do it in segments. Whatever. All right, here we go. Going for 14 reps here. Here we go. Do -de do -de do. Push through the heel. One. Two. Three. Hold it at the top. Four. Push out against that band. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 14. Nice. No, Resurrect, every time I go longer than two hours, it always cuts out. It's not my, it's not really something in my control. It's more Twitch limiting my ability to stream long streams. I don't know why, but they always cut me out at two hours which is annoying. Sorry, I'm not really actually that mad, but it does kind of suck for those who are watching on YouTube because my video just gets cut in the middle and now I gotta figure out some way to edit it when I don't have an editor. So it's stupid. Literally every time I stream any longer than two hours, it always cuts it off. For whatever reason, I don't know. Like, you guys think streaming is just internet. It's really more than just internet. There's a lot to it than, than just having good internet and a good computer. We're likely to fill in for partner streamers. I don't know. I don't know, dude. Beats me, but it just sucks for those of us who are trying to be, you know, doing something. Hey, thanks for the follow. No, I wasn't trying to leave y'all hanging. I have, I have to finish this workout. All right, y'all, we're doing 50 pounds now. Let's go. We're gonna do 12 reps. Sorry about this stream cutting out. For some reason, always at like two hours, I get cut off. I'm a little butt hurt, mainly because I don't know how to edit the video now. And I even joined early because I knew y'all wanted to see me and wanted to hang out. And I wanted to hang out. But then they were like, the universe was like, screw you for trying hard. <laughs> so I'll figure it out. I don't know. I really don't know. Maybe you guys know. 
and know something a little bit more about streaming than I do as to why Twitch just cuts out at two hours. Okay, Whew. going for 12 reps. Make sure you pause. Aw, poof when I got back. I'm so sorry, Conrad. Thanks for the follow on YouTube though. You're a real one, bro. For those of you who follow me on the YouTube, I thank you. I thank thee so much. That is my ultimate goal, is to get my YouTube up. Twitch is just a platform I use to get content out on YouTube. So if y'all really want to show your growth or the Fit Fam some love and support, you'll go check out that YouTube. All right, here we go. Well, let's get 12 reps here. Push through those heels. Make sure that band is pushing out as well. Pausing at the top. Inhale the way down. Pulling yourself down. Two. done with the workout too. Okay. When was my profile picked from? Um, last year, I think. Yeah, probably last year when I was all being cute. Okay, that is it y'all. I don't know how I'm going to edit this for the YouTube, but we'll figure something out. It might have to be in two parts, so I apologize if I end up having to break it up into two parts, but um, thank you guys so much for joining on the stream and checking out the YouTube and showing all the love and support over there. Y'all are awesome. You know that? It's because of you guys that I show up continually. Thank you for being my motivation. And I'm happy to be here for you guys to kind of help you stay educated on all the different exercises. And remember, stay blessed, my friends. Y'all are awesome. Make sure you go get some protein. Go eat some food. Give yourself some fuel for tomorrow's workout. We're going to be doing a glute circuit as well as delts in there. So we're going to be working on those boulder shoulders. Okay. I love you guys so much. I will stick around. I'm just saying bye to YouTube real fast. Until next time, my friends. See ya.